Hey, Jen here with California Baby Love. Today I want to do a video on all the baby gear that we got for our baby. She's not yet born yet. I'm currently 37 weeks and five days pregnant. And when I was picking the items, I was very selective about which baby gear items I put on the registry or that we purchased because we do have a relatively small home. It's about 900 square feet. It's two bedrooms and the living spaces are just a little bit compact. So I didn't, did not want all of the baby gear just cluttering up our house. So I was sort of careful about what items we put on our registry and what I thought we really needed and what I thought maybe we could go without. So after baby comes, after a couple months of using all of the different gear items, I'll do a follow-up review and talk about how these items actually worked for us and if we ended up having to purchase other things or if baby liked the things or didn't like them. So, so the first item I want to show you is the Arms Reach Co Sleeper. And the way this works is it's sort of like a, a miniature crib that's at the same level as the mattress and it's lower on one side. This thing comes with some straps here which I have not attached yet because um, currently we don't keep it right here because the baby's not born yet but it has these straps which clip on each side into the side and then basically this strap runs all the way underneath the mattress and it has a stopper which keeps it really tight up against the mattress so there's no crack and you know um, pulling baby onto the bed in the middle of the night for feedings you're not going to have like a crack in between the mattress surface and the surface of her bed. Um, it does come with sheets which I don't have on here right now because I wash them and I just want to keep them like from getting dusty and until she comes. Um, it has some nice features. It's collapsible and it has a carrying case so I feel like when we go to our in-laws house then we can bring this and she can sleep with us there and you know it packs up nicely into the car. And it has a couple other features too. This is the sleeping mode, but this level bar here also comes all the way up and the level of the mattress can go down and so it turns also into a playpen. And it's nice and small for our space, so it's, it actually has a smaller footprint, I think, than most pack and plays, which appealed to me because we have a small space. So my husband Ben and I share a queen size bed and we want to be really close to baby, but we just don't want to risk, you know, any of the dangers that come with possibly co-sleeping, like having her in between us. We're both kind of heavy sleepers and I just don't want to worry about it. I mean, truth be told, if we had a huge bed, I would actually love to have her in the bed with us, but this is the next best, best thing and so it, it feels like a good compromise. Um, we put this item on our registry and so it was purchased for us. It retails for around $160, I think. and. I like it a lot because I think that we'll get a lot of use out of it at different stages. So the next item I want to show you is this Fisher Price My Snuggle Bunny Bouncer. So it's a little bouncer for the baby and it um, plays some music, different ones, some nature sounds, has volume control and also there's a vibrating button so that I guess that soothes the baby. So you can strap her in here and then these just dangle. They don't really move or play or do anything but this seemed like a really important item to me because I thought that maybe when she's little and you know I can keep my eye on her in the kitchen but put this up on the table like if I'm preparing dinner or bring this into the bathroom with me when I'm going to take a shower and just have her nearby but really in a secure spot. And then I've seen friends, babies, when they're a little older, they can actually start bouncing themselves in it. And it's really adorable. So this was on our registry and it retails for about $55. Um, the next item I have here is a ball. And this is just something I picked up at the exercise section at Marshall's. And it was exactly what I was looking for, a pink ball. <laughs> bright pink and we might even bring this to the hospital with us when I'm laboring because I heard they have limited number of balls there and I definitely want this for when I'm laboring but also this will be used to bounce baby and I've heard some babies love being bounced on the ball. So I'm not sure if you would consider this item really gear but I'm going to include it in this 
video. This is the crib that we got. I purchased this at Ikea and I had my eye on it for a long time because I really love the pink accent drawers on the bottom and plus I just love that it gives us the extra storage. So um, we got this at Ikea. It was $200 and I store like her sleep items and her bath towels down here. She's got all her swaddlers and then this is all her bath towels and bibs. And then we just have some other little accessories like I bought this musical arm on Amazon and this little mobile is also from Ikea and it's adorable. It has a little sheep, a kitty, and a duck hanging upside down and it coordinates with the little pictures which are also from Ikea which have the same lamb and duck and kitty. So I just love this. I think it's adorable. She <clears throat> probably won't be in here very much in the beginning but then maybe during nap times we'll have her in here and then when she gets a little older and I don't know we'll just play it by ear. I don't actually have any specific time frame of when she's going to be sleeping in her crib but we'll just keep her with us as long as we want to and then when it's time she'll sleep in here. So one gear item that I was going to buy but then a girlfriend of mine actually gave me hers is this Bumbo and I just love this. I don't know why. I like the shape and the feel of it and it's like a soft foamy seat that baby can sit in this before their back muscles are actually strong enough to support them up. It helps support them so they can be in a sitting position. Um, probably won't, she probably won't be able to use this till she's a couple months old I'm guessing but I think that this will be great for like when my husband and I are having dinner we can sit down and we can put her on top of the table like right in between us and she can sit and be part of the conversation I guess but um, I think this retails for between like 40 or 50 dollars and I got it for free from a friend so super excited about this and I love the minty green color. So the next piece of gear I want to show you is actually a pretty big item for us. This is our stroller. Um, oh by the way this is our big dog Dexter. He's a black lab Rottweiler mix. Hey buddy. So this stroller um, is the Bob. It retails for $385. This is the Bob Revolution Flex. And I'll definitely do a follow-up review on this item to tell you what we think. But this was a really big one for me. Um, so I'm going to show you how it opens up. So there's a safety clip here. And then basically you just... And there it is. So it's got a lot of awesome features. Dex, you in your bed. Um, it has shocks on it and the front wheel can be stiff or you can make it so that it's turnable. Um, I do plan on going jogging with baby once she's big enough to support her head. And so this bar right here actually allows us to put our imprint carrier into the stroller, which I'm going to show you next. And so we did buy a stroller. Um, we bought the Brutax Be Safe, which is compatible with this. Um, and I just think this is just a really awesome stroller. It's got really good reviews. The only downside of it probably is that it is so large, but I don't mind. I can't wait to use this. So this stroller has tons of features and once we actually get a chance to use it with baby, I'm gonna do a follow up review on all of the specs on this. So the last item that I wanna show you guys is our car seat. So I'm gonna step out of the way and show you in a sec. And it's already installed in our car and I'm just too pregnant to fuss with taking it out right now and putting it on the stroller to show you. So just use your imagination. But this um, car seat, works perfectly with the Bob stroller with the adapter bar so I'm gonna step out so you can see it's called the Britax be safe and it's an infant car seat it has the base that attaches in the car and then 
it has a snap and go feature so it's really easy to just pop out you know if baby's sleeping and you get home you don't want to wake her up you can just bring the whole car seat into the house and leave the base in the car and then you know the the infant um, carrier part also snaps into the top of the stroller so I can use that stroller from day one with her and you know go for light walks or go get a coffee and bring her with me in the stroller so that's about it for our gear if you have any questions or comments please leave them below and please do subscribe to see updates and videos on our family and um, I'll probably do a video with Ben pretty soon to introduce him to you guys and baby should be here anytime so thanks for watching